Hello, nice to meet you guys and congrats Hello. on the show. Hello, thank, thank you so you. much. So I have a feeling after everybody binges this, they're gonna to wanna to learn more about Midori ASAP. So because both of you got to share scenes with her, what is it about the way she works on set that makes her an ideal scene partner? Um, Midori is very, um, uh, she's very thoughtful in her, in, her, in her process, as you would say. Mm -hmm. Um, but she's very fun she, and she's she's open to playing she has a she, she has a very i don't know if other people i mean other people obviously know this but to me she has a very like powerful laugh that kind of starts small and just gets bigger she'll sort of go like <laughs> and you're just you're like oh 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 but it's very fun she's 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 wonderful <laughs> she's 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 great she really tapped into her character and really wanted to to get it Perfect. So I think both her and Austin were on a perfectionate like like tip when I was when I would work with them. But me being a perfectionist as well, I I thought it came across and me being a, a like a deep looking into how people go into their acting and and go into their roles and do their things. She really tapped in and would really concentrate and focus on what needed to be done. And she would go and ask Joe all the time, "Is this right?" And, is this is this going right? It's just and 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 so it, it just pulls everything together. And I think you can see how hard she worked on getting everything right from the skip, from like the turnarounds. Everything that she did was like really on point. You didn't name She's drop the meticulous. dance though. That might have been one of the best of the bunch. The dance with the, with the elbows. Dance to me, the elbow. She went crazy. She went ham. Like that's that was one of my favorite scenes. Like. So I can't dance, but I feel like if I steal some of her moves, I might be okay. Yeah, yeah, you might, you might, you might do some things. One of my favorite parts of this story is the idea of sharing hobbies and how sharing your favorite hobby with someone else might bring something new or good out of them. So what is a hobby that the two of you have that you might put in a notebook like this that could bring the best out of someone else? I would I, I would I would have sent whoever to an improv class because that's 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 hot or cold. They either love it or that's their worst nightmare. So you can that's, really read someone. That's pretty sick. Um, me, mm, I don't know. I would probably send them to like a, a studio or or have them like meet one of my friends that records and see how well they do in in that atmosphere and around people. Who Make them safe. So that's, I would probably send somebody to a party or something with my friends and see how well they do with that adventure. <laughs> my anxiety level is through the roof right now. So I feel like you both nailed that answer. Cool. I also love, I love celebrating holidays period. And I love how this movie really gets into the Christmas spirit, but any holiday of your choice, what is the most unique holiday tradition you have? For me, Christmas. And not, and that's not even just like saying Christmas. It's, it's Christmas because my family, we all, it's like we come home, it's like a reunion, like family from out of town. We got family like like that stays on that block. And then we all come to my grandma's house from youngest to oldest. They they rip open their presents savagely. Like, and then we'll go to the like the basement of my grandparents' house and we'll like throw a party. DJs there, all types of stuff. So it's it's super lit. Like my family's my family different. <laughs> that sounds like a blast. <laughs> it's lit. <laughs> My family on my dad's side, my, my Japanese family, growing up, all of the aunts and uncles would write a Christmas play and then make all of the cousins perform it for just them. Um, and it, it, it was, it, it's everything and nothing that you can imagine it was. There was one time where we did the nativity scene and then there was another time where we were, we were the Christmas tree and I was the star. And I just like stepped forward and did this monologue where I was the star. Um, I don't remember any of it. I've blocked it all out, but I know that it happened. 